What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to implement cache into WordPress websites using WP Super Cache WordPress plugin. The most simple to use and free WordPress plugin by the main WordPress developers in collaboration with some other amazing developers that can make that can be used to make your site faster. It can make your site loads faster. There's a lot of documentation into WordPress.org website with useful links and link to the developer's documentation where you can learn more about the WP Supercache API. And of course, you have the forum of support where you can ask questions. So, in our latest video, that I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and a card over here, we did learn how to optimize images into our WordPress websites to make it load faster. And now, once it's uh, just a little part of the website optimization, speed optimization, a second good step would be using cache to speed up the WordPress website. And for this, we're gonna be going to our old WordPress dashboard. After that, go to plugins, add new, and in the search field, we're gonna type WP Super Cache. We're gonna be installing the plugin. Of course, you can download the plugin into WordPress.org and install by the .zip file, but this method is as easy as so. Now the plugin is already installed, we're gonna click on activate. No need to worry about this Nazi, it's just because I'm on localhost, in the normal domain this is not gonna happen, so you can dismiss. And in the case that you see this message in a, in a normal hosted website, you need to have a look and talk to the host support team. And let's scroll down until you can see the WP Super Cache plugin, it's activated. And if you go to the WordPress settings, in the left sidebar of in the left sidebar and panel of pages, you're gonna see the final item called it WP Super Cache. It's pretty simple to enable cache. In the very first option, in the easy tab, we're gonna set caching on the recommended. We're gonna click on update status. And we are good to go. Now all the pages can load faster by saving a static version of the HTML files. And of course you can play with the plugin settings on the advanced tab, where more experienced users can change every single part of the caching control. I only recommend these changes in the case that you have some experience and have read, have read the documentation of the plugin. But this one I do recommend, the caching timeout. By default, it's this number. But we do recommend that you increase it for, length, or for something like 5000 for example. You can set email notifications in the case that you want when the cache cleanup and you can enable or disable cache for specific post types like single blog posts for example. And of course you can control what kind of users gonna see check gonna see cache because if you are writing a blog post and you see not the updated version it's a really bad and of course you have the cdn control system of cache that you can integrate according to the cdn the content delivery network system like cloudflare for example you have the contents where you can see the number of cache, the number of cached pages, and can clean up the cache. 
I'm gonna leave here a link in the description below and a card where you can see a video tutorial where I do explain when you and how to clean up the cache into your website. As you can see, it's pretty simple to enable the plugin to work and, of course, have some advanced settings that you can play with according to your level of experience. However, with the Easy tab, you can handle the request of enable cache into your WordPress website. And in, and in the case that you want more, more resources to learn about the plugin, there's a yellow tab in the right side, or side of the plugin page where you can see a lot of useful links. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question, and don't forget to check out the visualmodo.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes. And I see you later! All the best!